Hi, this is Paul Howell, Managing Editor for Singapore Business Review. Today I'm presenting the Technology Excellence Awards, celebrating all the best, the brightest and the most innovative digital projects from across Singapore over the last 12 months. Winning in the AI for telecommunications category was Tetherfy, and I'm joined now by its founder and CEO, Vineeth Nair. Vineeth, great to have you here. Congratulations. Hi, thanks, Paul. Uh, it's, it's a pleasure. Can you tell us a bit about your winning project? This is the Tetherfy Work From Home Solution. What's that all about? This solution is all about addressing a problem statement uh, that, that we saw due to the current pandemic, uh, which uh, uh, just disabled some of the contact center industry employees to work from uh, office. So they just couldn't get to the office. So the, the next best solution was to have these uh, people work from home. And that uh, led to a lot of non-compliance, security uh, aspects that needs you know uh, that had to be addressed, and uh, that's when uh, we uh, came in and we looked at this challenge as an opportunity, and uh, we already had a bit of us, uh, our video solution that could actually figure out employee happiness uh, as well as customers' happiness. So we were doing a bit of AI using our emotion detection. So using this model, we kind of enhanced this further and started looking at what are the external threats that would come into, uh, for example, somebody trying to bring a phone to capture data from the screen, right? Or someone else peeping behind my shoulder, right? Or is this beneath actually logging into the system uh, to take calls? Uh, and we used facial uh, biometrics to authenticate uh, uh, an agent uh, or an employee in the contact center. Uh, so the combination of all of this uh, with identity management, security and non-compliance uh, detection, uh, which is continuous uh, authentication as well, led to a solution called uh, remote security, uh, Tetherfy's mm -hmm. remote security or work from home solution, which kind of addressed uh, uh, this issue of people enabling all these enterprise contact center employees to work from anywhere. So that's kind of a, uh, a solution mm -hmm. that kind of uh, led to this, or the problem that led to the solution. It's a really exciting development phase, um, and born out of COVID, but certainly with a lot of work that went in previously. Absolutely. What, what is, is there one particular element that you are most proud of? Uh, yeah, so I mean, that's, that's a very, uh, emotional question for us, primarily because in the contact center uh, industry today, the biggest challenge is to have these people come to office. And predominantly, if you look at the industry, all these calls or interactions are going to developing nations. Could it be India, Mexico, Philippines, and some of these places where the, the cities are choked, the infrastructure is choked. And one of the key elements for us to have these employees work from their rural areas was, was something that we discovered along the line when we started this you know, project. Which means these people sitting at the, at the comfort of their house with their uh, you know, family members, they could take calls without having to travel anywhere. And for enterprises, it enabled them to downsize, reduce the real estate uh, in, in terms of cost and all this logistics of you know, moving people in, in cities was a big, big advantage, right? And this kind of led us to look at the purpose of this product where we, we saw a huge um, uh, kind of an energy for us to develop and do more with this product where we could enable rural people to be employed as part of this program, right? So this product is enabling all of these uh, in, in a nutshell, right? Is this technology applicable to other industries outside of where you're currently working in that contact center space at the moment? I believe absolutely, absolutely. Because imagine uh, somebody in the procurement team in your enterprise having a lot of conf confidential data on the screen and it could be some competitive pricing and he's going back home with that laptop 
and how are you going to protect that that confidential data on the screen uh, avoid capture uh, from the mobile device or somebody else beeping in so i believe strongly this is going to go beyond just contact center industry i think everybody in the enterprise who has confidential data on the screen would need this solution now technology is always changing uh, particularly over the last few years i think we've seen uh, how does Tethify look to say look to stay relevant uh, in such a fast moving and competitive environment that's a tough one um, uh, usually usually we we have to look within uh, to make sure are we having enough innovation uh, and, and continuous innovation. And again, we have to look at the market and see, are we solving customers' problems? And then the combination of the customers' problems and our continuous innovation to solve those problems is going to be very, very key for us. Uh, and at the same time, uh, we have to have the mindset of, of a startup. And we have to stay hungry and we have to keep winning. And, and these are combination uh, is very, very crucial for us to stay relevant in this competitive industry. And what will be your focus over the coming few years? Are there further initiatives that uh, your clients and customers can look forward to? Sure. I think uh, the world has been so unpredictable, right? And that's obviously giving us a lot of challenges. And every challenge for us is an opportunity. That's how we look at it. And uh, I think our clients in the market would be looking, should look for more more innovation, more new features, more functionalities. And I think we will continue to grab all kinds of challenges the market throws to us as an opportunity. And finally, Vineet, what does it mean to you and your team to have won at this year's Technology Excellence Awards? Super excited, of course. Uh, but at the same time, I think uh, this will inspire us to do more uh, innovation uh, and uh, it will probably put more focus uh, around R&D uh, that we've been doing uh, in, in Singapore Centre, uh, which will obviously result in more of, you know, features, functionalities and innovations that's going to come up uh, as part of our solution. Vineet Nayak, thank you very much for joining me and congratulations once again. Thank you so much, Paul, for, for having me here and uh, uh, it's, it's a great honour. Uh, to represent Tetafi uh, and, and humbled uh, uh, to be part of this uh, uh, event. Thank you so much.